my goal is not to um, punish the parents. It's to get them involved. But how he wants to do it has people from across the nation accusing him of playing politics with the lives of Tennessee's poorest children. Tennessee Senator Tracy Campfield wants to cut welfare benefits to parents who have children that don't make the grade. Campfield says his goal is to help impoverished children. News 2's Joseph Pleasant talks to the senator about the nationwide opposition to his plan and his surprising source of support. Genesee State Senator Stacy Campfield is known for introducing controversial legislation. He drafted the so-called Don't Say Gay Bill that sparked protests at the Capitol, national criticism, and this Facebook page calling for his recall. A new measure that ties a family's welfare benefits to student achievement is doing the same. I always say education is a three-pronged stool. You have the teachers, you have the schools, and you have the families. Campfield's bill cuts federal welfare benefits to families by as much as 30 percent if a child in the family is truant from school, fails a course, or drops out. One thing I want to make very, very clear is that there's a misconception out there that this is going to stop some sort of food stamps. It doesn't. People who work with children who could be affected by this legislation say the answer is not to cut money to their families, but to invest more money in programs that help those children be successful. Coach Maurice Fitzgerald and his wife run the In Full Motion program. It targets at-risk youth and helps them with ACT test prep, college planning, and other life skills. We're talking about children and uh, versus uh, adults who are made adult decisions. Uh, children are our responsibility. Coach Fitzgerald says lawmakers should focus on removing barriers for low-income students. Barriers like transportation to extracurricular activities and access to tutoring. We have, I think, the priority, a high priority to make sure that we do everything in our power to make sure that these students are successful. Senator Campfield told me he hasn't gauged support for his measure on the Hill. But if the buzz created is any indication, it will no doubt cause debate. At the Capitol, Joseph Pleasant, Nashville's News 2. This afternoon, Senator Campfield introduced another bill already causing controversy. The bill would require school officials to tell parents if their child is, quote, engaging in homosexual activity. The bill is part of Campfield's so-called Don't Say Gay bill that passed the Senate during the last session but failed in the Tennessee House.